This is Bill Whitaker in South Lake Tahoe, California, the site of the devastating Angora wildfires. People are being allowed to return to their homes today, and this is what they're returning to find. Unimaginable devastation. This looks like a war zone. This fire gobbled up whole neighborhoods, and now what's left? A chimney here, a staircase there, and just a few days ago, this was a vibrant, beautiful neighborhood nestled in the middle of the forest just south of Lake Tahoe. Now, if there is any good news in all of this, it is the weather. For the past 24 hours, the weather has been cooperating with the firefighters. The winds have died down, the humidity has risen a bit, and these are conditions that have helped the firefighters get a grip on this fire. It is, it is largely contained at this point. But uh, that could all change because the weather is expected to change tomorrow as well. The winds are expected to rise again. The humidity is expected to fall again. And these are the conditions that spawned this fire in the first place. Now, right now, the uh, firefighters are saying that this fire looks to be human-caused. There was no lightning or anything natural that would have caused it. But they don't know at this point whether this was caused intentionally or not. An investigation into that continues. This is Bill Whitaker from South Lake Tahoe, California.